Hi everyone, thank you for joining us today. My name is Barbara Bravo. I am the College Access Fellow for Sonoma Valley and I have some 10,000 degree students with me here today. Um, they will be giving us some 101 senior year advice, so stay tuned. Please describe your senior year in one word. Fine. Dressful. Dressful. Overwhelming. Intense. Unforgettable year. How did you feel when creating your college list? So stressed because I didn't know what I wanted to do at that time. Um, I had no idea what I was doing or what I was getting myself into. What things did you consider when creating your college list? The social life on campus and the sports and obviously the academics. To make sure that they have my major and having one school far from here. Environment of the school, the acceptance rate, the location, the population of the school, the demographics, and the average statistics of test scores, GPAs, and so forth. What were some positives about your college application process? You seeing the benefits of different colleges, seeing what they offer, and the community around. I had gotten most of my essays done, and I kind of like had an overview of what to expect, but also 10,000 degrees have a lot with that. Well, we had um, workshops, so I found that really helpful and they guided me through everything. That I learned how to fill out an application and it made me more comfortable filling out things in the future. I had a lot of support and help from 10,000 Degrees and Ms. Connors from the College of Degrees. What were some negatives or challenges about your college application process? Filling out multiple applications for financial aid. Something that I didn't do was order a tax transcript, so then I had to go to the IRS for three hours. And I recommend getting that done in October when you're supposed to do it. And I ended up doing a FAFSA for the year prior to it, but I had enough time to do the correct FAFSA for the year I actually going into college. To reset and make new passwords all the time. It was just finding the time to complete the applications and going in and talking to teachers for letters. What is your number one piece of advice for seniors? Pay attention to the people that are trying to help you out. Stay positive. Do your financial aid and FAFSA early and don't wait last minute. Please start working on your UC essays if you're applying to, to UCs early on. Don't leave them until the last minute because they're super, super important and they could honestly make the biggest difference in your application. Take it serious and don't goof off. It is very important you check your portals and then also your email because for some schools you get accepted through your portal or, or they'll tell you through email. What do you wish you would have known at the beginning of your senior year? How to relax and calm down. <laughs> Make your scholarship list early on, like as soon as you're beginning your senior year or even like during summer if you have that spare time. That you ask for help and that you shall receive. Any words of wisdom for seniors? Focus on your future and have fun, but do it to an extent. Everything you're gonna do is for you, and like no one else is gonna do it for you, so you should take pride in what you're doing. Freeze with real friends. Don't hold on to negative people for so long. I think you should be organized and concentrate on your, on your academics, but also spend more time, as much time with your friends as possible. Because it's senior year. And have fun. You know, like, life's short, so like, you know, gotta enjoy while we're at it. Like, senior year, like, you're not gonna go through it twice. Start early, you know you're gonna go somewhere, and you have a great future ahead of you. And that is all we have time for today. Thank you to the 10,000 degree students who were able to join us today. Um, we wish you luck in your college journey, and good luck to the seniors going through the college application process this year.